Yeah, it's good to see you guys. Um, I think the big the big part of this, the question to answer is why is there this is there's so much rotation happening, right? We've been going back and forth all year long. For the most part, value has actually outperformed uh, growth um, by about 11 percent if you're looking at the Russell 1000 indices. But the last couple of weeks, Sarah, actually, it's felt more like growth is trying to make a comeback. And I think a lot of that is because we are seeing we're hearing people getting concerned about we're at peak economic growth. And oh, by the way, there's absolutely no inflation. It, it is 100 percent transit. I don't really subscribe to, to those things, as you know. I think maybe we have seen kind of peakish growth in the economy, but I expect it to stay strong because I expect the stimulus still to be kicking into the system. And now we're about to get an infrastructure package, which is who knows if it's a trillion or two trillion, but it's a lot. And so I think that that's going to act as a tailwind for the economy. I think the one interesting data point this week on manufacturing was that we're starting to get a CapEx cycle. So the Richmond Fed came out and they saw CapEx spending up 42 percent. That's an all time high. That's something new. That's a new nuance because we've been talking about PMIs and ISMs forever. We've been talking about durable goods and accelerating orders forever. So that's a good sign, I think, and encouraging and another tailwind. And of course, we know the consumer remains strong on inflation. I actually do think if you talk to any company out there, I actually do think there is wage inflation. So maybe commodity inflation is transitory, but wages are going up. Ask any company out there. They can't get people. And when they get the people, they can't even, they have to pay up for them. So I still think this is a recipe for cyclicals, economically sensitive stocks, reopen names. They took a pause over the last couple of weeks, but I think they will resume. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.